What is up guys, Rhythm Rider back again with another epic adventure. Today guys, I got something really awesome for you. A big abandoned colonial mansion. This probably dates back to, I don't know, the late 1800s. It's big, it's abandoned, it's decayed, and it's got stuff inside, so let's check it out. guys so this is one of the front porches of this abandoned mansion now this was just a random find driving along saw it said let's check it out now when I got in here a raccoon scurried down into the basement you can see a well-worn path so I won't be going into the basement guys I know I know but I just don't want to do it because I don't want that raccoon coming out after me and there is raccoon poop all over the floor Look at this guy. So wait, wait, I'll show you in a second, but here's like a back room here. Just storage and stuff. Nothing really here. Got that creepy light bulb hanging there with the decayed ceiling. Classic. But look at this room right here, guys. Love the old clawfoot tub, the sink. Like this bathroom is so dated. Love it though. And of course you got the old stove. So it's small kitchen. But then, oops, got a big living room here with a fake fireplace. I don't know if there, there must have been one there at one point because I can't see the spot up top there on the wall where the pipe would have gone through. We got a nice built-in cabinet here. The little sailor kind of hat look at the light fixture kind of funky another great big room looks like some late plumbing put in here got a PVC pipe or is that a no that's copper copper Nice big bedroom or something. Not even sure what this would be. Not a bedroom because there's a small closet right there. Look at this, eh? Nice big rooms. Oh. This seems like it's like a living room, but there is a table, so it could have been a dining room. Got a nice TV there, fireplace. I like those lights that were there on the around the fireplace. But you can see guys, the K everywhere. So over here, this is the second front porch. And another great big porch. Just full with random crap though. And trucks whipping by. It's a busy street. Just strange that this thing was just sitting here like this. Look at the staircase and the wallpaper. Okay, let's go upstairs, guys. Oh, this little secret cubby room here. We'll go check out those rooms in a second. But here's a little bedroom, and I want to see what's in this little secret room. Uh, just storage, as you can see. Oh, another clawfoot tub. Nice big bathroom. Plenty of storage. Another old sink right there. Oh, a kitchen. Huh. 
really old and nasty looking stuff. Storage. Oh, the stairs looks like over here. Let's go see what's up here. There's a lock on them. Ooh. The air is not great, guys, and look at the ceiling. Completely frigged. Whoa, there's another kitchen. I feel like this must have been multiple units. It was originally a mansion and then it was later converted into some sort of rental units or something or multi-family dwelling. Got a small bathroom right here. Just a closet there. Ah, there's another staircase and I think that comes in by that second floor uh, bathroom. Oh yeah, I got some decay going on up here. Nice big closet there. <laughs> Loving that green uh, trim work or trim painting. Oh, look at this couch. That's old school. That's something you'd see at a cottage or something. Nice big room. The ugly paneling everywhere, but look at, you can see, this might even be flocked. No, it's faux flocked wallpaper, guys. So that's the third floor. So as you can see, guys, this mansion's huge. Three stories. I'm gonna go down these stairs. So as we saw earlier guys, a bedroom there. This is actually a nice bright room. We got lots of windows, bright paint. Nice big room. You could have like a nice little chilling area right there. We got a monster bug right there. I don't know what the heck that is. Looks nasty and mean. This connects over here. We got Urbex Zay right there. What is up, Zay? <laughs> so this could probably be the master bedroom, I'm assuming, just based on the size of it and the location. I do like the wallpaper peeling off. You've got, you know, clear evidence of the plaster coming away from the wall. All the rooms are nice and nice and big for the most part. And then staircase. Now what I like about this area is that it's just so huge. Like the corridors are just massive. Like you even have space to chill out up over there, which is pretty cool. All right, guys, well, that's the end of this epic adventure. Big abandoned colonial mansion. So awesome, decayed, random find. But anyways, guys, tell me what you think in the comments down below. If you're not subscribed, definitely subscribe. Smash the like button. Remember, guys, always come back, because Ridden Rider always has that epic shit. All right, thanks for watching. Peace.